Hi, I'm Sophie and welcome to my world. Today I'm going to be continuing our series of purse faces. Now, if you haven't checked it out before, we have an entire series of little purses where you can change the faces and make them into any little animal that you like. Now, today's animal is going to be a kitty cat and this was suggested by Giselle B, Victoria R, Emma J, Melanie R, and Nova Spotty Dog. Now, my sister has a little cat named BB, and so we've designed the purse after her friend BB, who looks just like this purse face right here. I'm going to teach you how to make one right now. So for this project, the first thing you're going to need is you're going to need a purse body. Now, if you don't know how to make this, just go back to our first original tutorial when we started making the purse bodies for all of these cute little face purses. Make yourself your first purse body. Have it whatever color you want it to be. It doesn't have to be black. I'm just going to be using black for this one because that's the color of my sister's cat, BB, and we're designing it after her kitty. So make your purse body. That's the most important thing. Then you're also going to want to make a piece of fabric that is seven by seven, and this piece of duct tape fabric should be the same color as your purse, whatever color you've decided to make. And it's double-sided, same color. Also going to be needing a little piece of parchment paper. I've got my sticky back Velcro. I've got my different duct tapes with me here. Some scissors. The template that can be downloaded at sophie-world.com, which has all the pieces. And you'll want to print that out and then cut those pieces out. So you have those all cut out ahead of time, just like that. And in this case, I'm going to be using some little sticky jewels that I have, and these are going to be for embellishment. Now, to make my face, what I'm going to do is take this piece of fabric and lay my face on top of it. This is my face template right here. Now, here's the thing. When you've got this face template and you're using black, it's going to be very, very difficult to use a black marker or anything like that because you're not going to be able to see it. Now, if you have a silver marker, that's fantastic and you can certainly use that. Or here's a little trick for cutting things out when they are on dark surfaces. Take a little piece of tape, tape it, up and over at the edge here, like that. Now you'll notice, do you see how much space there is here? The reason I'm leaving that space is because this is where I'm going to be putting my two kitty cat ears. So I'm going to be using this one piece to make my face and my kitty cat ears. Now, all I'm going to do with this piece of tape here, I'm just going to cut my template right around. And that is going to give me my kitty cat face. There we go. All the way around. Just like that. So see, easy like that. Because I don't have a, a pen that's easily seeable on black, all I had to do was lay it down and cut around. And I would do the same thing with the ears. Now, I've already done this ahead of time, so I'm, I'm not going to waste the time on that right now, but I've got these cut out. But I would do the same thing if I wanted to. Now, I've got my pieces already cut and made here, but just to show you, you're going to be making stickers for some of this. I've got my two ears. They're already cut here, and, and I would have cut those from the extra pieces here. And then what I've done here is I've taken my piece of um, parchment paper, and I've laid down red, and this is going to be for the inside of my ears and my nose. See? You can see I've already traced those on the back. And then the white are for the eyes. And see, there's the white. And you can see I've traced those on the back. And then I've got my black inserts for the insides of my eyes. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually attach these pieces, and then I'm going to design my kitty cat face. So what I want to do is take my purse. Here it is. And I'm just going to pull the strap down. And I want to line my purse up right along the edge here, like that. And just make sure that it lines up nice like that. And then I'm going to take a piece of tape. I've actually got one cut here. And this is actually cut right down the middle. And I'm going to take this piece of tape and I'm going to do the half on, half off technique. So half on, half off. As you can see, they're sticky there. Now what I'm going to do 
I just open up my purse and lay the sticky side right inside, like that. And then I'm going to flip it over. And if it's a little crooked, I can adjust it here. Let's just adjust it here. There we go. Smooth that down. And then take a second piece of tape and lay it over top. And that's going to seal that on nice and tight. There we go. And now when you pull it through, you can see that the little face lines up with the purse. Now I'm going to add the ears. So I've got my ears here. And let me just show you. These would be cut out. And what I've done is just added a little piece of tape on the bottom. There's that half on, half off again. And I'm just going to lay these right on top there, and right on top there. Flip it over, and then I'm going to take a little piece of tape and seal them on the back side. Piece there, and a piece there. Now I can always come back and add an extra little piece here if I feel like it if I feel like it's not secure enough. And if there's any extra that sticks over, I can just give it a little snip. Get rid of any little extras there that are on the side. Now I'm going to take my in, inside of my ear. Remember I had made that cute little sticker. And I'm just going to lay it right on the inside of the ear there. And take a second sticker. Now you don't have to make red ones, you can make them pink, you know, whatever color you want your kitty cat to be. And remember, you can make your cat striped, you can make your cat yellow, you can make your cat any color you want. Now I'm going to add the eyes. One eye. And two eyes. And let's give a little red nose. There you go. And now we're going to add those really cool cat eyes. So this is just layering like a sticker. The thing about these purse faces is that once you have all the basic pieces cut out, you're really just laying them down and creating your design. So there's your kitty cat. Now, here's the thing. Because this is a black kitty, it's a little hard to see where the face ends and the purse begins. And so in this case, what, what we've done here is we've actually made a sticker that is going to be the collar of the kitty. And so let me just peel this here. Now, this I want to line up so that it is right underneath where the kitty's bottom of the face is. So see, then now you can see. So there's the collar. Then you can really see the little kitty's face. There we go. Now, I'm going to add that Velcro. Peel off one side of the sticky. Now, if you want to, you can use, you know, it's totally fine to use whatever you want. I mean, you can use a magnet, or if you wanted to, you could use a tongue closure. And if you don't know what a tongue closure is, just go to my um, homepage and put in tongue closure, and it'll show you how to make one. Okay, so I've got my sticky back. I place it right here on the back side of my front flap, which is my kitty's face. Peel off the back of the second piece of Velcro. So I had those two pieces stuck together. I didn't peel the Velcro apart from each other. I kept those two pieces together just peeled off the backer, and then I just push it down, seal it, so that's in the perfect placement. And now, here's where you really get to have fun. I'm going to take some of these little jewels and just embellish. Now, these jewels are so much fun to use. These you can get at most crafting stores. Um, or you can even find them at places like Claire's and stuff like that because they use them as like little stick-on earrings and things. And what's great about these is they have a self-adhesive back. 
They're plastic, so they're lightweight. And they actually do have a pretty good um, stick to them. Okay, I'm going to add one more here, one more here. And then let's just give her a little shine in her eyes because my sister's cat, BB, is very, very, very mischievous. And so she needs a little gleam in her eye. That's all there is to making a little kitty purse for yourself. Now remember, you can make it any color that you want. You can add spots, you can add stripes. It's really up to you because it's your cat design. For more fun purse faces, come and check us out at sophie-world.com. Thank you.